All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shah, Bahashem Rakhakadash. Double honors unto the apostles and the elders GMS who rule well, teach well, being great example to us younger brothers. And peace and blessing and salutation to the hopeful leg out there pushing this word in truth and in sincerity across the four winds in the name of Yahweh Shah pushing to get up out of here. Shout out to the hopeful leg, the believers, the listeners whom have came back to the obedience of the scriptures through faith in Yahweh Shah. And what I want to get into today, all right, dealing with the book of Proverbs 24 and 16, all right, because. Well, <laughs> As we understand within this walk, you know, you're going to have shortcomings, but there's a scripture, you know, that covers that. And at the end of the day, there's a scripture for every situation that must be applied. Okay? That must be applied. And that's something that, you know, I'm constantly learning. You know, we're constantly learning. You know, as we mature, you know, within this faith. Now, read this in Proverbs 24 and 16 which you know we bring this out you know a lot the scripture comes out a lot you know but to really you know go into it <laughs> you know for someone that you know has been broken or you know has failed okay in a way all right we really go into your scripture man okay it's a scripture of humility and understanding that your how about Shema was shy is overseeing you know the whole process so when you read proverbs 24 and 16 it said for a just man falleth okay seven times and that's a complete number of times all right and you go into the word uh falleth is nepal which is to be cast down <laughs> okay one of the definitions to be cast down man so there are situations that you know as a as a brother you know as a believer man you know for you, how about Shema Shah? Okay, we'll go through situations that cast us down, man. Okay, and you, how about Shema Shah, cast us down? All right, to 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 pretty much, uh, will force us to make some type of character adjustment, man. <laughs> okay, to force us to deal with some type of flaw. Okay, and the only way to deal. Sometimes it's to be completely broken so he can rebuild. That's why I say a, a just man, okay, a just man follows seven times and rise it up again. And that's the thing, man, <laughs> that, 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 that rise up again. Sometimes you might have to get knocked down to the very bottom, to the very beginning, okay? You have to be stripped down to nothing to be built back up again in a particular way, okay? But the wicked shall fall into mischief, okay? And that's Esau Edom. Because see, and, you know, two-thirds of our people that ain't right, you know, they fall, but they fall into mischief. They don't get back up. Like, when we finna see the judgment, they go forth, all right? Beginning with Esau Edom, these heathens, you see, they're gonna fall into mischief, which is judgment, man, Okay? But the just, the just fall and get up. And that's why I have all these examples, you know, through the scriptures, man. Because when you think about it, like I say, man, the experiences I'm, I'm going through made me see everything different, man, with more clarification. It's the, and it's the, and it's the very minute things, man. You know, because we can, you know, get so occupied in. You know the mysteries <laughs> of the scriptures. You know, you be, you be, you be read, you be to your neck. You know, up to your neck in precepts. <laughs> you see, you know, all underwater. You know, in the precepts. You see, but the understanding of the, of the shallow, the more things that are more shallow, all right, is it, more vital, man. When you have a true understanding of things that are shallow, man. You know, nothing wrong with having, you know. Um, a broad understanding, you know, of the scriptures, man. Okay, but the the but the but the, 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 the life lessons within the scriptures, you know, we can't overlook because um 
you gotta think about it. Yahweh Shai, before he was Yahweh Shai, he failed as Adam. Okay? He failed as Solomon. And it's recorded. There were some hard falls. But guess what? When he rose back up as Yahweh Shai, alright? <laughs> he had a completely different mentality, man. A completely different mentality, man. So he had to be Adam and fall. He had to be Solomon and fall. And, and fall. That created Yahweh Shai. <laughs> you see? Because when Yahweh Shai came, hey, you look at Adam and Solomon, what was it? Women? When he came as Yahweh Shai, he, he didn't even deal with women. <laughs> you see? They created a men them falls created a mentality, man. Because he had an important job to do, man. Okay? So let your fall create a mentality, man. Don't let these falls break us, man, because the scriptures say let not thy sins weigh thee down. And then it comes back and say, all right, don't be um, you know, uh, uh, uh don't be over wicked. You know, roughly paraphrasing. Okay? Because it ain't like we're intentionally trying to fall. Like I said, you can have sincere motives. Okay? And still be off and create a fall. Alright? But that was for a lesson to be learned. Okay? To draw things out of us. Because if we pray to be humble, most I uh, do things to draw things out of us that we didn't know was in us, man. Okay? And it's good, you know, that that, that it's happening before judgment, man. You don't want to find out in the midst of, uh, of chaos that you had distrust in you, man. Okay? That, 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 that you had these character flaws uh, 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 in us, that we have these character flaws in us that could cause us, you know, to stumble when we need to stand, man. You know, and we can't, you know, beat ourselves up about it. We gotta really reflect. Look at what brought us to that moment, because it was always a build up to that fall, man. <laughs> it was all it's always a build up. Okay? And I'ma say this. Just because in the moment you didn't have integrity, that doesn't mean, alright, you don't have integrity. Just because in the moment you know, you lack faith. That doesn't mean you don't have faith. Okay? Just because in the moment, you know, you uh, you were proud, that doesn't mean you are proud. They're just showing that that's still in you and got to be purged out. Those things, you know, those things are still within us and have to be purged out so we can fully be locked in. You know? So don't let the fall define us. Let it refine us, man. And you got to be broken down to rise up because when you are broken and you go into that word uh, edification, what does it mean to build up? So now when you read certain things, it's rebuilding you. When you hear videos and lessons, okay, Concerning your situation, what is it doing? It's building you. Okay? Because I read, I, you know, we read that scripture all the time, Proverbs 24 and 16, and just man followed seven times. But when I went into that word Nepal in the Hebrew, and it went to cast down, <laughs> you see, it went to cast down. And they hit home, you know? To, to, to the circumstances, you know, <laughs> that I was personally going through, man. You see? But it's all, you know, how about she might shot chasing whom we love, man? You know, and the water for the chastening, man. And, 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 and it be through men. It be through situations. And it be through, you know, his judges that he has set up in the earth, man. To judge over the, 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 the nation of the elect, man. Because the elect is a nation within itself. And that's why, you know, the, hey, if you if if it's, if it's a uh, uh, you know, cause we pray we part of the elect, man. We don't know it. That's what keep us humble, and that's where fear come from, man. Because, hey, 
we here by his mercy, man. You know, and we we not solidified, and, and things are happening to show that we not solidified, that we gotta keep fighting, man. We gotta keep, we got, you know, we gotta keep moving forward, man. We gotta keep growing, man. We gotta be more humble than ever, man. You see? And we just know this that, you know, they they that are his gonna receive a different chast chastisement than everyone else, man. Because if I say the elect is a nation within itself, so we got different we got different standards. Okay? Somebody else might can wild out and it be cool. But then you do one thing, alright, and the spirit is tearing your ass apart. <laughs> The spirit tear our ass apart, man. <laughs> you see? But that's a beautiful thing, man. That's 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 him dealing with us as with sons. You know? So y'all yeah, just want to put that out there. You know, Lord will. You brothers and you few sisters will, will edify, man. Stay humble, man. You know, even when even when you think you humble, humble down some more. <laughs> You know, humble down some more. You know, be 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 firm. You know, and, and confident. Okay, because you don't want to confuse humility with, with low self esteem. You know, so be firm, be confident, but humble down, man. You know, in these times. All right. So, Lord, will you brothers and you few sisters were edified? Till next time, I say, shall we walk.